Hey guys, so I've got multiple things to talk about. First of all, I want to do the giveaway of the Pharmacy Beauty green screen, which expires in about seven months, so be sure to use it by then. And instead of drawing a name, I entered all the names into an app for the Magic 8 Ball. And uh, when I press it, it's going to announce the winner, and then all you guys have to do is uh, message me your address or uh, in the about information page on my YouTube there's the no BS beauty email so you can email me your address there and I will get it out in the mail I'll probably include something extra fun for you guys too so okay let's see what it does Lisa Lowe Heslep so Lisa send me an email with your address and I will send you the green screen and then I'll probably include some extra goodies. So definitely uh, send me that. And uh, I'll definitely be doing these probably uh, once a week. I've got a few things I'd like to move on to a good home uh, so somebody else can get more use out of them since I only have one face. And that face is sleepy. That's sleepy, the dwarf. Okay. And then uh, I'm going to talk about the John Frieda shampoo collection. But quick, I just want to mention... I'm starting my 100 Days 100 Sheet Mask Challenge. I've already got the first seven days done. So uh, check out this week. Here's what I'm going to be using, or I've already used it and written it. I got a little bit ahead of myself. So uh, the Tony Moly I'm Green Tea Layering Mask, which was interesting. Uh, the Star Skin Firming Biocellulose Face Mask, Biocellulose Face Mask. Uh, the Claire's Rich Moist Soothing Tensile Sheet Mask. Let's see. Uh, the Skin Ink Black and Purified Black Gold Sheet Mask, which is a bottom and then a top part. So kind of making it more complicated. Uh, let's see what else. Oh, the Skin Food Propolis and Bee Venom Mask. The Aqua Ringer by Leaders Aqua Ringer Treatment Mask. And then the Patchology Illuminate Flash Mask. So start checking that out on nobsbeauty.com. I'll start uh, uploading those. And then uh, kind of a quick review, although I've been trying this for a while now. Not, not several months. Well, I've been trying this brand off and on. John Frieda has their whole Go Blonder line. And they used to have like a mask which came in a bottle. And you could just put it on your hair when you're in the shower and leave it on for like five minutes and rinse it off. It would help. I usually just use that for the roots of my hair because I'm kind of bad about getting the hairstylist. So I specifically concentrate that on the roots. They discontinued that and then they kind of re-released their Gold Blonder stuff. And then they released a new mask, which is their Gold Blonder Lemon Miracle Mask. But the key with this is, if you notice on all of these bottles, it says go two shades lighter which was really just enough to get me through to the next hairstylist appointment. But to be honest, the shampoo conditioner, it's all just fine. There's nothing wrong with it, but it really doesn't do any much to make yourself blonder or really help your highlights. And when you look at it, actually it says the little asterisk there by there, it says when using with the entire gold blonder system of shampoo, mask, and spray, really? The only thing that really does anything to help you go lighter is the spray. So you really don't need the shampoo conditioner. The Lemon Miracle Mask is nice. It really helps if you have uh, dry hair or damaged hair, but it doesn't really do anything to help your hair go lighter. The real thing is the spray. So, uh, yeah. So, I mean, it certainly won't make your hair darker. And maybe if you've got a very, very, very light highlight, it might give you a little bit of tones, but... Uh, it's got a nice yellow color to it, but really the only thing that you really need in this whole thing is the spray. Uh, it smells nice. It works well for a shampoo and conditioner. There's nothing wrong with it, but don't buy it expecting uh, really to go lighter unless you use the spray. That's it. And Sunbum makes a great spray. I really like theirs. Chlorine makes a good one. I really I like theirs as well. Sunin. I don't know. I haven't gotten to that depth, but Last summer, I experimented with all these different lighteners, kind of trying to get myself to not have to go to the hairstylist so often to get my roots colored in. And really, uh, the sprays are the only thing that works. And the Sun Bum, to me, honestly, was my favorite out of all of them. But uh, anyway, so I guess I'm just warning you, you don't have to buy all this stuff to really help your hair go, bl go blonder or really help your highlights or anything like that. Really, the only thing you need is the spray. Although I do like the mask. It seems to work quite well. 
uh, but you're not going to get any miracles or really help go any lighter unless you use the spray. So if you already have a shampoo and conditioner and a mask that you love, just buy the spray and you'll be fine. So I don't know. I just kind of wanted to put that out because I was just annoyed with myself that I didn't actually like read anything about it. I saw it go blonder, two, light, two shades lighter. I saw that. I'm like, oh, I'll pick it up. And then I realized, well, I ha still have to use the spray with it, which I really, personally, the spray is okay. I just found it dried my hair out a little bit. I really just like the sun bum. So really, if you want to go blonder, just pick up the sun bum, and it's on sale frequently. So I don't know. I just thought I wanted to put that out there just for everyone else in case you're thinking about buying it and you're on a whim like I was. Save yourself the money. Just pick up the spray. So anyway, that's kind of my video for today. It's Memorial Day weekend, so... It's finally warm in Minnesota, thank goodness. For the first time ever, we had snow a week ago. So anyway, check out nobsbeauty.com. Check out Teespring. My shirt's there. I've got mugs, stickers. I finally got my coffee mug, my No BS Beauty coffee mug. And I've got some fun new, new designs coming soon as well. So anyway, thank you guys so much and happy Memorial Day.